everyone welcome back to my channel today I have an unplanned Nordstrom haul they were having a sale and I was just looking online by chance saw everything was on sale and I just started adding things to my cart and it ended up turning into a haul as per usual I do not know if the sale is still going on but everything will be linked down below in my description box so you can go ahead and shop these items I was really happy with the pricing on these items so I hope majority of these items are still available on sale or will go on sale again soon because they do tend to repeat sales at Nordstrom I've noticed so before we move on into the try-on portion of this haul I do want to talk a little bit about Merit Beauty they did send me over two of their new lipsticks these are their new signature lip lightweight lipsticks and they are so cute I mean look at the packaging I love the packaging on these very very nice they also sent over some more makeup that i have used in the past their makeup is amazing they do specialize in minimalistic makeup which is perfect if you are busy if you are on the go if you like a little bit of makeup but you don't want to do a little bit too much i definitely recommend checking out all of their products they're very they're very high quality products i will say that they are beautiful they are minimalistic they work for everyone and every routine just because they're just so easy to apply you really don't need a lot of products to look put together so I do recommend their products I have used them in the past so I actually did use their eyebrow pomade to help fill in my eyebrows I do have on their mascara and I do have on one of these lipsticks so the shade I have on right now is called 1990 love this shade very fitting definitely reminds me of the 1990s I was only one at the time but the 90s, I do have a special place in my mind about the 90s, so that lipstick does remind me of it. And then this one is called Cabo, and this is what it looks like. It's a really pretty, I want to say almost red coral type of shade, so that's what it looks like. And look at that sleek packaging, very pretty. I love the gold packaging. And then the one I have on my lips right now, 1990, looks like this, so definitely more brown tone. Um definitely a 90s aesthetic for sure beautiful packaging i will say these lip products are very moisturizing they are definitely lightweight and they do show up on my lips which is sometimes a problem for me because my lips are naturally darker on the outside it kind of looks like a natural lip liner um so these actually show up on my lips so i do appreciate that so this one is perfect um for a more minimal look this one is beautiful for like a more still a minimal look but a little bit brighter so i do really like these lipsticks they do have more shades to choose from they're vegan they're cruelty free they're great for sensitive skin as well because i do have sensitive skin and these do not irritate me at all and on top of 1990 i do have on their lip oil and this is in the shade bell air so they have other shades in this one as well their entire collection is really great you guys i do recommend it i love their products and i'm really excited about these new lipsticks they did launch back in february I believe it was February 22nd to be exact so go ahead check them out I will have them linked down below for you guys so you can go ahead and look on their site if you want high quality minimalistic makeup this is the brand to go to okay so now let's move into the Nordstrom haul I think I'm going to start off with shoes first so I got about four to five pairs of shoes um so i'm just going to be pulling them out in random order again everything was on sale at the time no i'm lying not everything these were not on sale these i think were regular price um but they are so cute so i don't know how i feel about these just because i mean i do like the way they look i do like them i love the comfort level of them i'm not a fan of these types of shoes but something about this pair i just really really liked i like the look of them i just thought they were done really nicely they're still um, comfortable but they gave you a modern look very cute they come in other colors as well the only thing about these that I don't like is that they kind of make that little like flip-flop sound you know when you're walking and it gives you that like sound like I, I don't know how else to explain it like you're walking on flip you know what I'm talking about the flip-flop sounds so this is giving me that sound um, and that could be really really annoying so I don't know if I'm going to keep these or not just because of the sound everything else about these shoes are perfect they're comfortable they're cute they're going to go with a lot of outfits like the braided detail is just perfect. They're just really, really comfortable. I will say that they are super comfortable. I don't know if it's because my foot has an arch that it's just like creating that like suction sound and I do not like the sound it is creating because I do not want to be walking around all day sounding like a giant flip-flop. So that's the only reason I'm unsure about these. But if you for some reason don't have that issue and it doesn't make that sound on your foot, then definitely get them because I do really like them. And honestly, in the reviews, I did read um, that a bunch of people said the same thing. They said that it makes that sound. So 
it gets minus one star because of the sound if it was if there was no sound these shoes would get five stars automatically but because of the sound they are knocked down to four stars and these by the way are by the brand bp and bp is definitely a more affordable line at um, nordstrom i love their stuff they're definitely good quality but they're more affordable like i said so i picked up another pair of sandals slides from bp i figured i'd go with black because i did mention in a previous video I buy shoes obviously because of the type of work that I do. I buy a lot of shoes but I don't buy many in black for some reason so I stopped myself from getting the brown color and I got the black ones um, so I do really like these. These fit really well. They're comfortable. Um, they don't have that much cushion as the other shoe obviously because those were really thick but I do feel like these have enough cushion where you're going to be comfortable in them so I do really like these. I love this detail. I think it's so pretty. So definitely keeping these 100% recommend these. Check out the other colors. Again, priced really, really well. And again, I got another pair of shoes from BP. I believe these ones were regular price as well. I just really like them. In a recent Walmart haul of mine, I did pick up a pair of shoes, um, a pair of wedges, and now I have discovered a love for wedges. So I definitely wanted to try out a few more pairs. These are beautiful. So if you don't like the clear, they have it in black. I believe they have it in brown as well. But I personally love the clear look of it. I think it kind of like elongates your foot and your legs. Um, so I do like these. They're surprisingly comfortable. Um, again, because I'm not a wedge person, but these just caught my eye. They are beautiful. They are comfortable. They're surprisingly easy to walk in. Like, I love these. I highly recommend them. They're going to look so great with so many dresses and jeans and pretty much everything because of the clear color. So you can pretty much match these with so many different outfits. And I love the rattan, like, heel. Like, do you see that? It's so so pretty love this shoe highly highly recommend it another keeper for sure i'm so glad i got these because i feel like these might sell out fast just because they're a little bit unique and different so next up i got a pair of heels from vince camuto i love this brand i think they make really really nice pieces and um so this heel comes in a bunch of different colors this was on sale for about 50 something dollars. I did see a pair on Amazon that I will link down below for you guys that is always around $50. Um, these, when they're not on sale, I believe they're 100 and something. So I just got this chocolatey brown color. If you've been watching my channel, you know I love this color. And surprisingly, I didn't have any shoes in this color, which is kind of weird. Um, so I decided to get these because they were on sale. Um, and they're beautiful. I love, love, love the color. It's going to go great with so many pieces that I have. I think even if you don't have like chocolatey brown um, clothes, I just think this color is just beautiful on its own. So I will say the comfort level on these is not like at a 10. I will say it's more like at a seven eight for me personally just because i am not someone that usually wears heels all the time so for me heels are uncomfortable but i do want to wear them a little bit more i've been feeling like i need to dress up a little bit more um i have all these cute clothes and i need to actually not wear a hoodie you know what i mean it's spring summer is coming i need to i need to step it up a little bit i just feel like it so these shoes i do recommend i love them um comes in a bunch of different colors basic colors brighter colors um this beautiful chocolate color so i love these i will link the amazon ones for you guys as well just in case these go back to full price and you still want the look for less i will definitely link those down below for you and the last shoe i got are these slippers from barefoot dreams but i believe i picked up the wrong size um so these say medium seven eight which is what i wear in eight but i feel like they're a little bit a little bit snug and I feel like maybe I should have sized up to a large um, I mean they might stretch out a little bit they are very comfortable and they are super soft barefoot dreams is honestly the softest brand in the whole entire world that I have ever felt um, they just make the comfiest coziest softest robes sweaters cardigans blankets slippers like everything from them is just amazing these slippers are amazing I love them just the sizing is a bit off and honestly it does fit my foot I just wish it fit a little bit 
bigger, um, a little bit more roomier, but it does fit. But I might just keep them because I do believe these are actually sold out in this color. I believe they have another color available, but I like this one. So I will see. I will wear them around a little bit and see if they like loosen up a bit. And then I will make my decision if I should keep these or not. I love them. I highly recommend them. They are so cute. These would make a really great Mother's Day gift as well or Easter gift or something like that because, you know, those holidays are like right around the corner to be honest. So yeah, I definitely recommend these. Love them. Okay, so those were shoes. I do have two purses to show you guys. This one was priced so well. It's a large tote and this was priced at the time around $33 or something like that. Um, no, $36.75 and it's originally $49 and it's just a really nice large tote and it does come with a pouch on the inside as well. So I thought that was a pretty good deal for $36. So you can use it as a clutch, you can use it as a catch-all. Um, and what's really nice is that this tote tote actually has a zipper so most totes are just like one big open space so I like the fact that this one is actually enclosed well you can make it enclosed if you want so I do like that little detail it's a pretty big size so this is perfect for school or work or if you're traveling it can hold a lot and I think it looks really nice this is faux leather it's not real but I feel like it looks kind of real like you would not be able to tell that this wasn't real leather so I needed a tote well did I need it did I need anything that I picked up no not really right but I mean I don't have a tote in this color so I decided to get this one I love it they do have another one that they make um, in black I will link that one down below for you guys that one is usually priced really well regardless I think it's like $49 for the totes very similar to this and they do have like a reversible one as well so you can wear it um, on the brown side you can wear it on the black side so I will link those down below for you guys in case you are looking for a tote but I was so happy to get my hands on this one for only $36 because it is absolutely gorgeous and I love this color this cognac color has my heart love it highly recommend it so next up is a fun little bag I wasn't sure if I should get this bag or not but it looked so cute and I figured it would look so cute with little like tops and jeans you know what I mean like a cute top and jean outfit this is the perfect cute little summer bag because it's spacious enough to hold all your items it's long enough to fit over your shoulder you can wear it like this if you want on the wrist of your hand like it's so cute nothing is removable here so um, everything is as is it does come in another color this chain by the way is plastic so it's really lightweight so it's not going to be heavy on your shoulder and then if you open it up that's what it looks like on the inside so it does have a lot of room I don't know something about it just like it caught my attention um, also this would go really nicely with those wedges that I showed you I think that would be a really cute look as well I just had to grab it I think it was like $22 at the time which is priced really well which is a little bit cheaper than some bags on Amazon so I had to grab this one um, originally does it say how much it is so it's $29 originally so it's still priced really well whether it's on sale or not isn't it cute though like isn't it the perfect like little spring summer purse to just like throw over your shoulder with like a tank top and jeans. I don't know. I just really like it. So I would definitely grab this one because I feel like this one might sell out fast as well just because it's priced so well. Next up, I do have two beauty items to show you guys. They are priced they're, they're up there. The price is really high on these items. This is a perfume that I have been wanting for a while now. I love it, you guys. So this is the very famous Baccarat Rouge 540 um, by Mason Francis. I'm not even going to try to pronounce the last name, but this perfume is disgustingly expensive, you guys. Like, it makes you want to throw up expensive, but it smells so good. Someone asked me if it's worth the hype, and I definitely feel, in my opinion, that it is. I have never smelt anything so close to this perfume um, ever. Dossier that I do work with occasionally here on YouTube does make one, so I will link that one down below for you. So if you want the same smell, like the luxury smell for less, I will link them down below for you guys, and I do have a coupon code with them. So if you want to test out this perfume, um, you can buy the dossier one, you can go into store and try to see if they can get you a sample. So you can really test it out and wear it before you make the decision to purchase it because it is, again, make you want to throw up. Expensive, um, but this is what it looks like. It smells so good. Like, I don't even know how to describe it. It doesn't even have the... Does it have the notes on it? Does it say? Um, it just says made in France. It doesn't have the notes. I don't see the notes anywhere on this. It just says the ingredients and all of that. So yeah, I would go online, check out the ingredients. Um, the packaging is really cute and you can see like a little chandelier through the back of it. That's what the front looks like. It is 
it just smells so unique like I really don't know how to explain it you guys like this one there's just something about it that just like mm, like you you will not smell anything else like this like in all of my years I've never smelled anything like this and I think that's why it's just so popular now and it's so like people love it so much it's well loved because it's so different and unique like I have never smelled anything close enough to this except for the dossier perfume again which is a more affordable version of this so yeah I really really like this stuff you definitely have to smell it it is a little bit different and unique so make sure you like it before you purchase it oh my gosh it smells so good like you have got to smell it in store so another item that is ridiculously expensive but I just cannot live without anymore like once I tried it that was my mistake I should have never tried it because now I can't live without it um but this one is a little bit different from the usual one that I get so this is Lemur's face cream I usually get the soft cream um but this time I decided to get the moisturizing cream so this one you do have to like warm up in your hands before you apply it to your face just like rub it together and then apply it so I did want to try it just because they had like this little value set so you get like a little treatment lotion and then you do get a mask as well so that's why I got this little set I wanted to try this one it had really great reviews there is something about this product that is it just works so well so I stopped using it for a while just because I ran out of it and it's a little bit expensive and also I was trying to use other products to clear up my acne I have like acne scarring I have pimples like my face has just been going crazy the past couple of months and I've been trying other things to like get rid of it and then once I started using Lemur again I noticed a difference right away like it also helps with my acne and I didn't really realize that or I forgot about that um, part of it before and I should have just kept using it because it's getting rid of my scarring it's helping my skin look good like there's just something there are miracle ingredients in this product that I cannot explain that to me will always be worth every single penny because it makes my skin look so good like I notice a difference right away if I put it on at night and I look at myself in the morning in the morning in the mirror I look my skin looks so much better so I do recommend them I don't know anything about the mask yet because I haven't tried it I have not tried the lotion yet but the cream the face cream itself is amazing and a little bit goes a long way they also give out samples as well so if you go into Nordstrom or Bloomingdale's or wherever Sephora and you ask for a sample you can get a sample to try out before you purchase it because it is an expensive purchase but I feel like skincare is something I don't mind investing in because it's my skin it's like everyone looks at your face before they look anywhere else um well most people look at your face before they look anywhere else guys on the other hand do not <laughs> but this um this is actually a hand sanitizing mist by saturday skin i do like this brand i have used their products before so i just got this because one i liked the packaging that was the main reason i got it um it's sleek so it'll fit into my purse a lot better than the bulky hand sanitizers and it said it was a mist so let's try it because i actually haven't tried it yet is it not spraying oh there you go oh that's nice so oh that's nice that's a lot nicer than the glop of like hand sanitizer from purell it doesn't really have a smell, does it? No. Green tea and gardenia fruit, but I don't... I'm not really smelling much, so it's very, like, lightly scented, so... Yeah, it's very lightly scented. I'm not getting, like, a strong aroma from it, but it's nice. I like the fact that it's, like, a little mist, and it's sleek, so... And the packaging is cute, so I do like this. This haul is so random. There is no rhythm or rhyme to this haul. I just was looking at things on sale and like a few new products like those wedges and that's how we ended up with this haul. So these jeans, I got these jeans because they were on sale. These jeans are like the beauty products. They are just ridiculously expensive, but these were on sale at the time um, when I purchased them. These are in a size 32. These are by a Goldie. They're a high rise, a straight crop. But they cannot go up over my thighs. They are just way too small. So I cannot try these on for you guys just because I can't get them up. Like I can't, like, I don't know. So they're cut really small. So if you are interested in these jeans, definitely size up. Um, typically now I am a 31. The 32 is still too small for me. So maybe I need a 33, 34. I don't know. I really don't know. But they are really cute. And I do like the denim on them. They feel really nice. They do have a button up detail. Um, so I do like the jeans. I can see why people say that these are worth 
the splurge because the denim feels really really nice like you can tell it's good quality like and it's not stiff like it's still a good quality pair of jeans um that is not such a harsh stiff denim so they're pretty like soft for having no stretch to them so yeah if you're going to get these definitely size up I have no idea what these would look like on me because I just can't get them on um, and these jeans are dirty because I have worn them twice already these are by Good American um, I've talked about Good American jeans before on my channel I love their jeans um, Good American Express those are my top brands for jeans like I do recommend them those brands the most just because they fit my curvier body the best good american is where it's at for any body shape size style like it does not matter their jeans fit so well um so these are in a 12 i don't have the tag on them anymore but these are skinny jean and they do have like a little bit of a raw hem there the denim quality is perfect and it does have like tummy slimming effects to it so it does slim out your stomach a bit i don't know what kind of technology this brand uses but they always seem to help my stomach area which is an issue of mine so i love these jeans i highly recommend them um i did have to like wiggle a little bit to get into them but once they're on they're on and they look so good um so these have like a medium thickness to them i do recommend them i believe they come in other washes as well i don't have any gapping at the back um so if you're looking for a quality pair of jeans, I definitely recommend these. They do have some stretch to them. They're not like the stretchiest jean, but they do have like enough give to them. So if you want to check out Good American, I definitely recommend them. The quality on their jeans is amazing. The technology for like just making your whole, your entire legs, your butt, your stomach, everything looks good. Everything looks snatched in these um, jeans. Like everything from this brand makes you look snatched. So definitely recommend them. And I like these because they're just a simple pair. There are no like holes or like rips in them so i do recommend these so i also got this dress but it is too small so i can't try it on for you guys unfortunately because i could not zip up the back so i got this in a large it does come in other colors as well i love this color i just need an extra large i couldn't i couldn't get the zipper up basically so i do recommend this dress though this is a good basic wardrobe piece to just have in your closet um the quality on this one is really nice so it does have a lining on the inside in case you don't want to wear a bra with it it does have adjustable straps um just the bust area has that extra lining the material is nice and thick sometimes with these types of dresses if you do not get one with the right thick material it'll just come with the thin cheap material that kind of shows everything like every bump and lump and I don't like that look on me personally so I do like this one because the material is thicker it kind of like smooths you out it looks really nice on it's a decent length um the back of it does have like a little where is it? It does have like a little slit in the back of it. Um, so yeah, if you are between sizes, definitely get the bigger size. An extra large would have fit me perfectly. I hope they still have an extra large um, when I go back to order this because I really do like this dress. I'm about to get it in this color, the black color, like a whole bunch of other colors because it's a really good quality dress. I feel like this is a staple dress for your closet because you never know when you need a cute little like midi dress that you could dress up or down this one is perfect for that i highly recommend it then i just got a t-shirt a simple basic t-shirt this is by the brand treasure and bond this is in a size large and i just like the cut of this one um so i do like wearing tees in the summertime just like jeans and a tee is my usual go-to usually a white tee but you guys i love this color so i had to grab it um i like the fact that the sleeve is long um but something about the cut of the this one just like accentuates your curves like the way it fits my body I really do like it's lightweight um, so I do like it It does come in other colors um, it gives you like a rugged but still put together look and it does have like a little pocket there so I do recommend this tee I think it just I just think the way it's like cut just looks really nice on okay so next up I just got a bunch of pajamas I have been recommending Nordstrom pajamas to you guys for a while and I love picking them up when they're on sale normally during the Nordstrom anniversary sale I pick up a bunch of pajamas um, but I saw that they had it on sale right now so I had to grab some I'm due to like swap out my old ones and get new ones and like different sizes so the first pair of pajamas I got were these ones they have a bunch of different colors styles prints but 
but these were the ones that were on sale so I went with these originally they're $49 I don't remember how much I paid at the time but they were definitely more affordable sorry about my phone um, so this one is a really pretty green color it has this like vibrant pink trim going all the way around and these are a short pajama so that's what they look like I swear by these I love them I highly recommend them I've been recommending them to you guys for years now I love their pajamas um, if you want a dupe for these the ones from Target the stars above line they make a great dupe for these I love those pajamas as well I've been recommending those to you guys for years but if these are on sale I do rather get these than the Target one just because the quality on these are a little bit nicer um, so I got those and then I also got another set these are just a simple gray set and they do have a really pretty soft pink trim around them um, the material is just I don't know how to explain it the material on these is just amazing soft um, they wash really well so this one actually says it was $29.40 which I feel like is I think the target pajamas depending on if they're long sleeves or if they're short sleeves are $20 to $30 regardless so if you can get these on sale for the same price why not um, these are all in a large by the way so that's what the shorts look like love them and then I also picked up this set. So this set is actually in the short version, but the short version on me fits me like perfectly fine. So if you are on the taller side, then it will actually fit you as a short or a cropped pajama. Actually, yeah, it's cropped, not short. So if you are 5'4 and under, it'll fit you like a regular <laughs> length pajama. So I got this one as well. This beautiful like lilac purple color with a darker purple trim all the way around it so I do like these and this is what the bottoms look like it does have that trim at the bottom as well and it does have a functioning drawstring love these pajamas and then the last one that I got is from a brand that I did purchase during the Nordstrom anniversary sale and I love love that brand um definitely recommend them those were the first pair of pajamas i purchased back then and they lasted until now like i still have those pajamas they're just stained of course um so they're by the brand bp so again affordable and i love the way these fit just because they have a fuller short sleeve so the sleeve is just more comfortable the quality on these is almost identical to the quality on this i believe bp is actually a nordstrom brand which would make sense as to why the quality is so good um and then these are what the bottoms look like definitely a little bit out of my comfort zone like the color palette is not something I would normally get but these were on sale I love the way they feel I love the way they fit so I had to grab them they come in a bunch of different prints there was actually a green one that I originally wanted that one has like stars and like celestial like prints on it I definitely wanted that one but that one sold out super fast so if they restock it I'm going to get that one so yeah that's pretty much it those are all the new pajamas I picked up from Nordstrom all the new shoes um a couple jeans things that fit things that didn't fit things that i'm not going to keep just because they make weird sounds when i walk so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this very random nordstrom haul don't forget to check out merit beauty down below um all the details will be there i will list every item available down below as well for your shopping pleasure um so yeah thank you for watching my video please don't forget to like and subscribe i hope you guys enjoy the rest of your day stay safe thank you for watching and i'll see you next time